of this week's Hellcats episode recap right now. Hello all you clever TV peeps, I'm Dana Ward at the studio with the episode 4 recap for Hellcats. Titled as Nobody Loves Me But My Mother, this one is all about relationships and love, and of course there's a little bit of cheerleading in there too. Now one interesting happening has to do with Savannah. She invites boy toy Dan to have dinner at her parents' house since they did happen to catch the two exchange a kiss, so S has to kind of prove that they're somewhat serious. But the nighttime meal is less than appetizing, as the rents tell Savannah she must choose between the boy or Lancer University, aka the fam. Now as far as Marty goes, there's a bunch of relationship talk with her mom. Wanda needs help to win a contest against the other peeps at the bar and desperately needs Marty's help. They bicker a bunch, but in the end, Marty comes through to sing for the bar patrons, resulting in a ton of applause from all. I guess there's also a bunch of Marty and Lewis relationship issues as well. She kinda denies a date with him, causing him to head over to Alice. Can we say hot and steamy between those two? Just in time for Marty to reveal that she's ready to date him. We can't forget that Hellcats does have something to do with cheerleading, so there's a bit of drama when the team totally freaks out about the competition from their rival team, what would they do without some casual competition though? I gotta add that there are a whole lot of games played between Savannah and Dan throughout the episode, and in the end, he does say that he can do the exclusive thing, but it might be a little difficult. Oh geez, Dan, oh Dan. So, these are the main happenings for this episode of the Hellcats. Like I said, tons of relationship happenings, and we're kinda left hanging as to what's gonna go down from here on out just the way we should be. Okay guys, make sure you guys follow us on Twitter for more news and recaps on the CW's Hellcats. You can find us at Clever TV. I'm Dana Ward, thanks for tuning in.